at Cocktail Conversations, candid insights from startup founders, entrepreneurs, and thought leaders from around the globe. Launchpad is a co-working space and accelerator based in New Orleans. Uh, we started about four years ago, around about the time of the whole co-working movement. Um, have about 100 people that work there on any given day and sort of at the, the hub of the, the New Orleans uh, tech ecosystem, which has been really blossoming and, and uh, growing. And uh, we've got some great companies that are here at South by Southwest out of Launchpad this week. New Orleans definitely has uh, unique opportunities. I think that um, we, obviously, people are aware of Katrina, the, the whole sort of tech and uh, startup renaissance happened post-Katrina. Um, people sort of rebuilt their lives, their houses, their businesses. And about three years after Katrina, we said about, all right, how do we actually make the community better? Not just what it was, but, uh, but better. And so um, we opened up a, a physical hub. I think one of the interesting things that's going on in startup movement right now is the, is the importance of physical space and people working together. Um, so we opened up a hub, put all the tech, build, uh, tech companies in the same building, and we opened up a co-working space in that building. Um, and that created sort of the nexus for, for where things were happening. Uh, at the same time, all of these smart young people were moving to New Orleans and have been moving to New Orleans, first to make a difference, uh, and then as they fulfilled their work uh, with rebuilding schools, being teachers, uh, a lot of them have become entrepreneurs. And so there's a tremendous energy in the startup scene right now, driven by uh, all of these people that have been moving to New Orleans over the last few years. Nico Nico is a, is a product that's, uh, that we're launching right now, um, and it's around happiness in the workplace. So along the theme of co-working and uh, working on, on products we love, sort of, I think that a lot of what uh, we're all uh, doing here at South by Southwest, we're all working on things we're passionate about. One of the things that I believe is that um, productivity, performance is really impacted by being happy in the workplace, well-being in the workplace. Jen Lim, who's the, sound, the, the CEO of Delivering Happiness, Brian Welly, who's with People Analytics with Google, and I have a panel together to talk about, uh, the panel's title is Geek Nirvana, Achieving Data-Driven Happiness. So uh, the product's actually sort of, um, the, the focus of the product is uh, understanding the well-being and, and, uh, and sentiment mood of people on your team, and it sort of aligns with the quantitative self-movement of tracking, uh, you know, like your run keeper where you're tracking your runs. This is actually tracking your mood and tracking your happiness and generating that data. Well, I think, you know, it's very much aligned with, uh, with, with doing something that you're passionate about. I think we all have the privilege here uh, in, in this community at South by Southwest of uh, working in a, in a field that we all really love. And I think staying true to that, a lot of uh, happiness is actually driven by, uh, by meaning and by, uh, by, by working on uh, doing work that you're very proud of. Uh, so it's not just positive emotion, it's not just how you're feeling today, there's a lot of other attributes uh, that are actually really driven by doing work you're passionate about. I think that uh, balance is a very difficult thing to maintain and um, uh, productivity and operating at a high level uh, actually sometimes comes from taking a step back uh, and, and, and being able to um, uh, engage in a very deep and meaningful way, whether that's with colleagues, whether that's uh, getting the opportunity to uh, engage in some deep thought for yourself, strategic thinking. And I think people focus on being busy. There's a lot of competitiveness around being busy, but you're not actually doing what's important uh, for, your, for, your, for your company. I think it is, uh, my, my, uh, my girlfriend out in the audience would say it's extreme networking, networking to the extreme. Uh, I always love South by Southwest, got to meet a lot of great people, and um, there's a lot of fun opportunities, and, and you know, I love networking, I love meeting people, so that's probably what it is, extreme networking.